Being gifted uh, as a kid, I think it can help you um, accelerate grades and, and, and so forth. It may help you with schoolwork, but at some point, uh, at least in, in mass research, there's, a, there's only so far that uh, sort of smarts and training can take you. You, you. you really need persistence and maturity and, and working with others and, and basically all these other life skills. I work mostly in pure mathematics. Um, sometimes I work with applied mathematicians and then they take the work we do and then they, they collaborate with, with uh, other scientists. The, the subject itself is changing. I mean, it, it, it used to be people working on their own in isolation, you know, solving problems all by themselves. But the problems we deal with these days, uh, both in math and in science, they're so complex and interdisciplinary. You need um, um, uh, collaboration. And I enjoy collaboration. I mean, it, it's, it's a lot more fun. You know, there's at least one other person who's interested in what you're doing. Yeah, I mean, some of these, some of these math problems, some of them, they just sort of torment you. You know, you, they ought to be solved. Right? And if you can't solve them, you, you, you just keep going back at it. And so it is very satisfying to actually knock one of them off. Yeah, as I said, most of my work is pure, but uh, there was one work that did have many practical applications. So it was, um, it was a new method to uh, extract data, like images, from measurements, um, like, uh, like an MRI scan, uh, but using much fewer measurements than, than uh, previously. Um, so an MRI scan, which might take, say, two minutes to, to fully scan, say, a lung, can now take 30 seconds, because you, you have to stop breathing for, for that period of time to get a good image. And so uh, can it can even be life-saving to have a shorter MRI. So it's almost the only thing I've done that's actually saved lives. Maybe it's because you know there's, there's been the, the the tech boom and the dot com boom and so forth. And so, um, you know, nerdiness is sort of cooler maybe than, than it was in the past uh, because they they see people like Bill Gates and Steve Jobs and so forth, you know, be, being successful. And also, the, the, um, so many more um, um, jobs in the world these days uh, they do require um, some mathematical training. I mean, it's, it's it's no longer just something for ivory tower academics.